Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Wild World. Where we left off, we, uh, didn't do a whole lot, to be honest, but that's A-OK, -okay, because now we are back for more content. <laughs> and I had to get on here quick because it's almost 12, and I want to make sure I check those turnip prices. So, yeah, before we do that, I'm going to just check around town. There's some weed, got to pull that out. What else? What else? Okay, it's it's about to be 12. Okay, I, I, I can't. I got to cut this short. <laughs> We're checking around. Uh, okay, purple rose, I guess. Cool. <laughs> That's pleasant. Alright. No spotlight item. That's fine. Uh, turn our prices. Okay, it's not great. That's fine. We're gonna go check up top. We got a whole pink bed up here. I gotta get that for Lexi. Most definitely. And, alright. It's about to be 12, so... Just gonna wait. What do you got? Oh, nice. Uh, anyone move in? Finally! Dottie! Who is Dottie? Is that like a bunny or something? Like, I'm trying to think. Like, Dottie sounds familiar. I feel like I had her in GameCube before, but I can't remember. At the top of my head. Anything on the bulletin board? Yay day? Okay. Balls and windows don't mix. Play ball, play safe. Well, you don't have to tell me twice. Get rid of you. We don't need you here. I will grab this though, and I'm probably gonna sell it to be honest. We're getting too many flowers. I don't know what to do with them all. <laughs> I guess we could replace some of the pink flowers with these purple ones to get more variety in. I know I said I wanted more pink flowers, but I think we're getting too many pink flowers. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I'm gonna be real with you, Chief. We got too many pink flowers up in here. Apollo, let's go talk with you. <laughs> How's it going? Okay. Well, I haven't seen anyone yet, so maybe she's home. And she is. Okay. Hello there. Aww. That's sweet. Alright, we got a gift for you. A wrestler shirt? Okay. Yeah, I figured that wouldn't be your style. It just seems like a weird choice. Apollo. 
Oh god, not the front view. That's so disturbing. Uh, it was alright. Old flooring. Cool. I appreciate it, bro. I'm glad you're not sick anymore, either. Yeah, I think Dottie is a rabbit. I'm pretty sure we had her before. Like, come to think of it. Uh, yeah. Goodbye. We shall replace you with purple tulips. We just need some more variety, that is all. Up oh, there's Robin. Alright, what's up? Okay. Well, if it's about food and stuff, he would definitely know a lot about it. Though he seems to talk more about tea, strangely. Okay, let's go check out Dottie. I'm pretty sure we've had her in GameCube. Yeah, we did! I was born under the perky sign of Pisces, and my name's Dottie. Get the feeling you like to walk around. But you can't be as good as me, it's what I do for a living, we won. <laughs> what a flooring and background, dude. What, what do you want? <laughs> oh my god, her eyes. Um, hello, I haven't even finished unpacking. You know, not everybody thinks impatient people are cool. I am curious what her house is gonna look like. I was not expecting such a desert theme, dude. Is she based on anything from the... I'm curious, like... I'm, I'm curious what she might be based on if this is what her house is like. Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> Like, it says she's based on a Dutch rabbit, but I don't know what that has to do with a desert. Okay. I don't know, what do you guys think? Because I feel like there's a reference I'm missing. Ah, well. Alright, I gotta take care of the Jacob's Ladders, and... Just the Jacob's Ladders, okay. Alrighty then, no problemo. Let's go check on the ribot while I'm down here. See what he's up to. And he's sick. Why did I have a feeling that he was sick? Oh, poor guy. Alright, we're gonna have to come back with medicine for him then. But hey, at least he's got a neighbor. And it's cool that Dottie's back. Pretty sure we haven't seen her since, you know, GameCube. And I think, if I remember right, Bones took the place of where her house used to be. Oh, I did not mean to grab that. It's fine, I'll just sell it. Alright, cool. Yeah, it sure is. Alright. Looks like I've checked just about every corner of town. Only people I haven't spoken to are Bones and Gabby. But before I do that, I'm gonna get my coffee on. The 
because dag nabbit, I need some coffee. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> All right. I have some more coffee time. Here we go. Sweet and mild. Someone did mention in the comments that the you can actually see the coffee switch uh, swish around a bit, which is a nice bit of detail, and I'm kind of surprised they went the effort for it because the screen is so small you might not even notice it. Like seriously, how would anyone be able to see that when the screen on the actual DS is just so tiny? kind of crazy how people, like, they thought that we would see that. <laughs> Gabby's walking around. Okay, I haven't seen Gabby anywhere. I don't know if you guys have, but I did not see Gabby at all today. Okay, let's go check on Bones, since I can't find Gabby. This is a place where men meet and discuss important manly things. I gotta spruce up your space with lace and flowers. Damn right. Bones knows what's up, dude. Okay, well, I'm gonna go... Who's talking? There's Gab... There's Gabby. Okay, at least she's not upset. That would have been awkward. I saw one. You said you were a cute girl. I thought you were a pretty one. Nailed it. <laughs> Saved. Alright, we're gonna sell some junk and... for the money rock as well. But first, I'm going to get medicine for ribeye. Yep. Alrighty then, let's go. Ah, my hand. <laughs> my hand's cramping. There we go. I love it when we get it quickly. Alright. Cool. Very cool. That saves me a lot of time. So with that being said, let's go put this up. Then, we shall go take care of our flowers. Along with the red turnip. Alright. 
on. That felt like I overshot it. There we go. It's cool that my videos are making it to quite a few people, though. Like, I received a comment where someone said that they got this, like, one of my videos of Animal Crossing on their For You page. And it was flattering when they said that they expected me to be a bigger channel. Like, it, that, like that's pretty cool. Like, it's cool that, you know, the algorithm is being nice for once. <laughs> Maybe people are just starved for Animal Crossing content ever since, you know, New Horizons. I think a lot of people stopped playing New Horizons a while ago. And they just want to see the old games again, so... Maybe that's why the algorithm is working. People just miss classic games and want things to go back to the roots. I mean, New Horizons isn't a bad one, but I think it's just that there's not as much character to it. And it feels kind of repetitive after a while. You know what I think would have made things so much more tolerable though? If there was a feature where you could craft multiple at once, because if it gets so tedious having to craft individual baits every single time, even though it can stack, like they should have let us at least craft 10 at, at most. Like, that would have just been such a nice quality of life improvement. But I don't think they ever did that. And I think they kind of abandoned the game, like, a couple years ago. <laughs> Which is unfortunate, because, man, the game could have really used some quality of life improvements to make it easier for us to get into, you know? Like, it really could have used some stuff that would just make it a better experience to play. But that's just my opinion. And hey, if if someone that if someone working at Nintendo stumbles upon these videos and my word gets out there, then I'm for it. Also hire me for the next table crossing. <laughs> and I want a Lexi villager. That is all. I want a cat villager named Lexi. And it looks like my cat. And she should be a sisterly villager. Or Uchi, or whatever it's called. Because, dang it, she is very protective. <laughs> like, you, I was thinking either that or Peppy, but I think Sisterly makes more sense, because my cat's very protective of me. So, yeah. Yeah, I don't know, man. I just feel like... New Horizons could have been better. Feels like the updates were things that should have been in the base game. I mean, I appreciate that they were free and not DLC, because that would have been really scummy. But... It just feels like it was stuff that should have been part of the base game to begin with. And that... 
updates should have been, you know, some new stuff. Like, like what they did with the museum, that was pretty cool. Like the museum having extra stuff you can do in it. But stuff like Brewster, <laughs> like that should have been part of the game from the get-go. But it wasn't, that's kind of cringe. Just saying. All right, let's go bring this medicine to Ribot. Because apparently this can take care of robots too. All right, we got it, buddy. Take care. But, yeah. Another thing, golden tools should not break. Like, that was the whole point of the golden axe, was that it could never break. So, making it breakable still is kind of stupid, I'm sorry, but it is. That would be like... If say the bigger on sword like that would break at like at first and once you upgrade it it doesn't become breakable anymore but imagine if it if it could if it still could like it would break but after a longer period and you would have to go back to get it repaired like that's lame okay that's like that just feels stupid because of all the effort you go through to make the big Goron sword in Ocarina of Time. Same thing with all the effort of getting the golden axe, the golden rod, just all the golden tools in general. But yeah. Anyway, we're done here. Next time on Wild World, we will be back tomorrow. And we shall see what else there is to accomplish. At least Dot, we got a new villager. Dottie seemed pretty cool. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys then.